Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Today I want to share this wonderful recipe for Egyptian rice. In Egypt they call it roz. And it's a staple dish to every single meal in Egypt. The only dish that's more popular than this one is koshery. But I could share this recipe with you later. So let's talk about Egyptian rice. It's absolutely wonderful dish. It's steamed rice with toasted noodles. Let me show you how to make it. You will need a cup and a half of a vermicelli pasta and vermicelli pasta is a very thin pasta similar to angel hair but cut into little pieces. You are also gonna need two cups of white rice and I'm using the medium grain rice very high quality and guys use a high quality rice. You are also gonna need three tablespoons of ghee which is a clarified butter but if you're trying to make this dish vegetarian you can use vegetable oil you're also gonna need one tablespoon of salt and a teaspoon of pepper and no other spices because adding more spices to this dish will compete with the dishes that you're gonna be serving this rice with in a five quart pot with tight lid add your clarified butter and we're gonna heat it up until it's not sizzling but like kind of heat it up a little bit then we're gonna throw our vermicelli pasta and we're gonna start toasting it on the medium to high heat until our pasta is gonna start getting some color as you can see guys it's turning a little bit brown we need to toast it to a very dark brown color almost like a chocolate brown if i can describe the brown shades after that we're gonna add our washed and drained rice and we're gonna cook it for about two minutes or so then we're gonna add our salt and pepper and we're gonna mix it together sometimes a little bit of coriander added to this dish but I decided not to since I'm going to be serving it with some meat and the meat is going to have coriander in it. Then we're going to add for every cup of rice, we're going to add one cup of water and uh, we're going to add one cup or maybe less than a cup for a cup of vermicelli. You can use your spoon as a guide to measure the water uh, level, but I usually say maybe half an inch above the rice. And then we're going to uh, crank up the heat and we're going to start, uh, start the boiling process. And as you can see, guys, you can see bubbles a little bit. And as the boiling process are going to start, you're going to see the rice is going to get plumped up and the water or the liquid is going to start slowly evaporating and I will show you uh, when you need to actually stop the boiling process and put the lid on as you can see now the rice plumped up and there is practically very minimal water left in the pot it's time for us to cover it and look at this guys I have this little steamer cover on my lid but um, you can use a towel and then you're gonna steam it for about 25 minutes and look at this guys after 25 minutes your rice is absolutely done and because we toasted the pasta look at this guys is not mushy you can see every single grain of rice in this dish it's absolutely beautiful and it smells like toasted pasta i encourage you guys trying this dish it's very delicious in egypt it's usually served with tomato sauce or as a side dish to a lot of meat dishes so i hope you guys like this video thank you guys so much for watching please like and subscribe and i will see you soon